Hello, I'm Evelyn Block, the immediate past president of the Jewish Federation and a current board member representing Temple Adith Israel. I'm also the vice president of programming for the Lexington chapter of Hadassah. I support the Federation for two main reasons. One, I am deeply concerned about Jewish continuity and the task of perpetuating Jewish identity from one generation to the next. And two, for the unique services the Federation provides that the other Jewish institutions do not, such as PJ Library, Jewish Family Services, Camp Shalom, and learning opportunities from the various rabbis in the Jewish community. This week's Torah portion by Yechanan from Deuteronomy is filled with many important events. Three of these, which are Moses being denied access to the land of Israel and the repetition of the Ten Commandments and the Shema. I would like to briefly focus on the meaning of the Yechanan, which is, and he prayed, referring to Moses' praying to enter the land of Israel. And so we ask, why did Moses want to enter the land? Our sages say that he desired to perform the mitzvot that were only capable of being performed there. However, there is a deeper answer. Because Moses was not merely concerned with his own spiritual fulfillment. Moses knew that if he were able to enter the land with the people, he would be able to bring about Moshiach's coming. So, why didn't God grant his request? Because God desires the redemption not be a product of the divine service of only one or even several righteous people, but of the people as a whole, every man, woman, and child doing his part or her part in bringing about redemption. To anticipate and prepare for that age, the world at large must be filled with godliness. Not only must several righteous people live in that manner, but this must be a way of life of the people as a whole. That is why it is the responsibility of everyone, and not just those of us who sit on the, on the Federation board, to ensure that we have a vibrant and thriving Jewish community. So please, join with me in supporting the Federation to ensure our future. May you have a Shabbat of rest and renewal, and Shabbat Shalom.